That's actually amazing. They they killed Chris him. Crystallized once more. They killed him without even using that uh, chrono. So now they have chrono if they want oh, to fight. Jump in, BKB even crystallized, and now Mace needs to get out of here. He's a little bit deep, and the chrono comes out. They found the Weaver. Can he do the damage? The question. The nice charge, beautifully the placed. Shards. Stops him in his tracks, and that was beautifully done from maybe next time. Now those charges are three. It's like, yep, TB just didn't like Dart. And TB was farming in the meantime. Don't forget about Dart. His farm is not the worst. He's on top of the net for chart. 300 or 400 gold over the Centaur. 400 over the Weaver. Ooh, good cancel. But not enough. enough. No extra help coming in there. Instead, they're just pushing down bottom ready. We're sitting on the Sentry. There's the X. He's not mana for time as He does after the Snake, but... Point 0.7. Oh, his Quelling Blade is on cooldown. <laughs> Gets it off. <laughs> <laughs> not enough. <laughs> run, no good, run! <laughs> I cannot believe that actually. I actually cannot believe that. <laughs> he's too much. People, he's looking for brain cells. He's, he's gonna be he has a stun. Oh, he dodges. He can kill him. He can kill him. <laughs> <laughs> we had <are> spotted him. <laughs> They spot him, they know. He is stunning it off, but he is gonna get hexed. Straight away, Ghosting jumps in, goes for the jump. Oh. Black Hole Blizzy! Oh he gets God. all four. Blizzy comes in with the Black Hole. There's the second to clean it all up as GG is cool. Sunstrike. Just kind of check in again. Grip. Grip on Bloodseeker. That's a great grip range with that Aether Lance. BKB popping quick, but they're going to kill the Tombstone. Rupture apply to somebody. Maybe oh, quick fight will wow. leave. As the Avalanche of Pino oh, combo, though, I from Vicky. Double kill for quick, but they're out. And Tiny will fall to finish it off. The combo. PL is gonna do so much from now on. Right? He's just gonna farm up. They, they, I mean, now, before I was saying it's not over for VP. Oh, they're gonna go for the PL. They should be able to find him. He's dead. 75 seconds sideline. Solo in the nightmare trying to move away. The arrow's doing a lot of damage. They're probably gonna be for BKB. RP coming into the boat. It's big. Turn around. Light strike ray as well. They're gonna be able to wipe through a wall. The Laguna to ensure the Necroboss goes down. And that is the turnaround the BP were looking for in that fight. Final alone here. Gonna be kept alive in the meantime. Shadow Grave, Roger getting low, shoot four, but no one's hanging around. Pretty much every time you see him out on the map, he's sitting around, so that 3k HP threshold. 35,000 gold lead is Zayat. It's a big lead. Quick blink Ooh. away. Very quick indeed is what he sort of saw straight away. And oh! Oh, the combo. Oh, the combo. Oh, 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 oh. We were waiting oh. for it. Picture perfect. I was thinking about this even I, I really thought one of the games where you may sort of be deterred and play from taking that extra Sakuchi move speed is when you're playing against a, a Willow and the Bloodseeker. Because that, that can happen. You're just dead. You literally just killed yourself with the speed that you're moving. He doesn't have the plus 200 there. He may have died anyway, but he doesn't die straight away from that straight-up combo. You know, it just, it destroys...